Former president of the Nigerian Bar Association, Dr. Lisa Bakoba, SAN, has lambasted the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission over what he described as unwarranted media trial of the Kogi State government as regards the fresh case against a nephew of the governor and the previous 20 billion Naira bailout controversy. Abakoba specifically noted that the EFCC was turning itself into a one-man Robin Hood riot gang, which must not be allowed. Abakoba made his opinion known just as he called on all the 18 candidates contesting in next year's presidential election to clearly state their commitment to the rule of law and the war against corruption. Is the EFCC's job to phone the MD of a bank and say, you know what, we want to deserve Abakoba's account to be pnd and we demand that you give us the statement of Kogi State. Okay, if it's their business, is it their lawful duty to make that inquiry? There's a case because it involves a lawyer, I won't mention it, his name, but I was so glad to be vindicated by the Supreme Court about five months ago. The Supreme Court, in a very strongly worded judgment, castigated the, the EFCC and said, look, you know, if you interpret your powers gra granted under Section 46 of the EFCC Act in the way you do, then it means that you are the sole law enforcement agency in Nigeria, but you're not. So the Supreme Court redefined the functions of the EFCC in a very narrow manner as prescribed by the Act. It is not for the EFCC to be chasing the Kogi state government and saying, you know what, uh, we're going to cut away papers from the accountant general's office or whoever, or go to the governors, like in the case of Oji Kalu, the FCC actually went to the government house, in spite of the fact that the governor, governor has, a, a, what do you call it, immunity, and carried away the government cashier. And this is not to say that we therefore condone corruption. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.